Hey guys, it's been now, it's 3.01 in the PM and wow, the grass is in line with itself. Hey anyway, wait, oh gosh. We gotta repel. Now repel is a handy item, it basically allows you to walk through grass and stuff without actually taking damage. What? No. No, it doesn't do that. It actually allows you to walk through grass. A repel goes for 100 steps and basically you won't encounter any wild Pokemon, which is very handy now. Hopefully the Shanks eventually will learn. I'm not going to really be battling with the Shanks until he's a bit high level. He's not going to be handy for the gym coming up, so that's that's where Toadwood comes in handy. But if Shinx learns um, an electric type move, which Shinx is electric type, then wow, really? Really? What is with all these starlies taking out my health after I'm calling a really kind of bad Pokemon? Like, Starly isn't awful. Starly is just... It's just a bit, um... Underpowered. Uh, underpowered for this stage. Excuse me for a second. Anyway, uh, so yeah, here's a cave. We're going to go in it. This is Orberg Gate. Uh, there's one. There's a trainer here. Oh, look at that! You got a Poketch. Um, you're still pretty new trainer, are you? But it's all good. You're a new fellow trainer, so here's a gift. Anyway, you can do a HM. HMs are like TMs, except you can use them as many times as you want, and they all have special abilities outside of battle, and they're, and they're mostly necessary in order to beat the game. Uh, you won't need fly to beat the game, but it's one of... <laughs> just, just the use of fly, and fly's always HM2. Now, we won't get fly until about halfway, but this one's Rock Smash. Now, you see those brown rocks, and not the one like... Not this kind, but the one kind of in the bottom right, like these ones. Uh, that's... Uh, that gives you a, uh, that, that's a Rock Smash Rock. Now, we can't continue because of the Rock Smash Rocks. Now, there's one new Pokemon in this cave, and we might see it. Here it is, it's Geodude. Okay, now Geodude, Geodude is a pretty good Pokemon. He's Rock, Ground Rock or Rock Ground, I don't know what the combination is, and Shinx not going to be a good choice, so I'm going to send out to Earthwig. Because thankfully now I can use Absorb to my advantage, because Absorb is a grass type and that's super effective against uh, Rock, I think. It's one of the two, like, I don't, I think it's Rock and not Ground. Uh, so anyway, yeah, uh, now Geodude it has some pretty good physical stats and he learns some great moves, but unfortunately he's Rock Ground, and Rock Ground, as common as a type, as a type combination it is, it's kind of bad because it's weak to about six types, uh, and and also Geodude himself he requires a trade in order to evolve to, into his final stage, Golem. Uh, Shinx is level eight and still no attack. Okay, uh, Turtwig is a bit underleveled. Oh no. Uh, so anyway, yeah, there's another Geodude. Geodude is a funny name. He's a first gen Pokemon if you're wondering. So. No way, you are not battling Shinx, no way. Now, Geodude knows defense girl, and that will increase his defense. Uh, but other than that, like, Absorb is a special- What are you- What are you eating, Turtwig? I don't- I don't understand. I think it may be his ability. I'll, I'll look that up. Yeah, Pokemon have abilities, and depending on- and that affects things, I don't know. Uh, anyways, yeah, even though the defense curl was up, um, even though they used defense curl, Absorb is a special attack, and that therefore doesn't actually affect, isn't affected by his defense curl. Uh, he has to use, a, like, I don't know, mirror code, I think. So anyway, Turtwig, learn Razor Leaf, which is a very handy move. Turtwig is now of, of, of use. Now, unfortunately, there's Picnickers. Campers and stuff, we trainers will accept challenges anyway, it's what we do. What are you doing in a cave? Got kicked out of home. So anyway, Camp Curtis, he has a Shinx! 
You know what we'll fight him with? Another Shinx! Actually, no, let's not fight him with another Shinx. Let's possibly fight him with the Biddulph. Go, Shinx, come back. Go, Biddulph, go up. Biddulph! Yay, he missed. You know what that means? Tackle! That didn't really do much. Oh no, we used Leah. No, my defense! Okay, let's tackle him again. No, my defense! Oh no, it's gonna do like half of my health. Oh, okay, ten, that's pretty good. Oh gosh, he's using Lyra again. Well, thankfully I might be able to take him out this turn. Yeah! Good on you, Biddle. Look how much that did. That didn't do much. Why am I telling you what I could just say? Anyway, so we got some money. Let's continue on. Oh, wait, there's a wild Pokemon. What? Wild Pokemon. You put a Geodude in the way. Thanks. Now, if you're thinking, oh, it can't, it can't be much longer until we get to the city. Oh, no. Oh, no. You can see the exit right there. That's Orbo City. Orbo. Oh, how do you say it? Orbo. 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 I don't know. Uh, it's the same spelling as uh, this place. Orbo Gate. I don't know. I'll just put Orbo. Uh, just because I'm bit. What are you eating? Please tell me what you're eating. I'm kind of overreacting. Uh, so yeah. Um. Anyway, if you're wondering why I'm not using Razor Leaf, it's because, uh, I... Oh, hey. Jinx is level 9! Jinx learned Charge! Now, thankfully, Charge is an Electro-type attack. We're good. Actually, it's an attack, right? And while we're at it, let's look at... Uh, yeah. Electro-type... No, it's not. It boosts... It boosts the power of Electro-type moves. It also raises special defense. Can be handy, but I don't know. Uh, oh, Overgrow, which powers up grass type moves in a pitch, and I think that doubles or whatever it's. Oh no, I'll search it up. Um, I'll search out what that actually means, and it'll come up as text right now. Anyway, uh, bit off, unaware. Anyway, this is another. Picnica to celebrate by getting through this game. I'm going to battle you to celebrate my victory. I will take your money, little kitty. Anyway, this person, Picnica Diana, has two Pokemon. The first of which is Beauty. Let's take a little moment with Shinx, just because we can. Yeah, Shinx is a strong attacker, so that, that thankfully does a lot. Now, growth increases is special attack and oh it actually I think growth does attack as well in generation five. Also in generation five you may be wondering if you're doing the switch out thing for experience, you may be wondering why you both Pokemon gain different experience rates. That's because they added a little thingy in the experience thing, so it depends on what po what your own Pokemon's level is that also determines how much experience you get. In this game it's all about just what the opposing Pokemon is, but this time uh, I should probably uh Let's see, anyway, this is Psyduck, he's a new Pokemon. He's kinda common, but not now. He, he comes up later. Uh, he learns a few powerful moves, four HMs as well, he can learn that. Uh, his evolution, Golduck, has some pretty good stats, and he can do both physical and special attacks. Oh, there's now. He can do both physical and special attacks, but as Psyduck, he's a bit okay. But he's a pretty good Pokemon, I'll say that. Um, wow, Shinx, you are doing awesome. Anyway, Shinx, gain experience. Yeah, that is awesome, Shinx. High five. Poor Arthur. Well, I guess losing is something to commemorate too. Yeah. Uh, so we got $80. And uh, outside. 
We're in Orburst City. Oh, howdy. If you don't have a single gym badge, other trainers will look down on you like you're a noob. No, seriously, he said noob. So anyway, he's going to tell you exactly what a Pokemon Center is. Now he's actually going to tell you what a gym is. Oh, wait, there's someone here. Oh, I have to actually talk to him. Huh? Oh, it's you, Bino. You finally got here? You're slow like always. You're so slow, the gym is long gone. Said he had to go, uh, oh yeah, to the mine. I got my badge ready, so it's no big deal, but... Okay. That guy in front of the gym, your friend, he's sort of twitchy and impatient. Uh, so yeah, uh, this is all the city. There's a few things we can do, but first of all, let's talk to people, because that's what we always do. Have you seen the vents? No. Uh, there's a trade we can actually do in here. Um... Yeah, uh, the gym leader went to work in the mine. Yeah, gym leader actually doing work. When I run around with my running shoes, I feel like I'm the center of attention. Uh, yeah. One of these people. One of these people would say something. Okay, let's search inside the buildings because we can do stuff. Yeah, one of these guys does a trade, and I'll be good. So there's eight trainers. Sorry, there's eight gym leaders in the game, and then you have to fight the. Elite Four, and then the champion at the end of the game. Uh, and that's basically our quest to get badges. I don't even care if it's about getting. Although in this let's play, our quest is going to get all the legendary Pokemon. Which in oh yeah, this person's going to trade a shop for Abra. If you want to get an Abra, actually, that's good. The only problem is you can't get him a shop. Yeah, actually we can. Yeah. Um. Pretty cool music. Actually, no, there's no, tr there's no other trade. That's that was the trade. Huh? No, I don't think we actually get anything. No, no, we can't really do anything. None of these people do anything. So stuff all those people. Stuff all those people. We're gonna go to the Pokemon Center. Yay! Do 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 do. Yeah, I got a power pad. Oh. You can get the pal pad, which is, oh gosh, what is with the emulator right there? So anyway, we can get the pal pad, the pal pad, oh, hello, right this way. So anyway, the pal pad is, oh, this is Tiala, this is the guide to the Wi-Fi club. Anyway, the pal pad, you can, it's basically a friend code list. And that also includes the friends you see locally as well, which is really... Oh, I press down, come on. So anyway, down here you can play against people on Wi-Fi, the only problem is that if you're playing an emulator like this, I don't think you'd really be able to. So let's just go upstairs and let's heal. Hooray! We hope to see you again too. Oh yes, we do. Because I'm probably going to heal after. Anyway, this is the mine! This is the outside of the mine! This is inside the mine! There is one new Pokemon in here that you can find. Ah, uh, This is just the opening section. But yeah, there's one new Pokemon we can find and that is Onyx! Which is not this guy. Uh, but anyway, Onyx has a really awesome defense and he learns a lot of great moves but he's kind of average and there's all uh, the stats and he also requires a trade with an item in the item we're running away somehow. Uh, yeah, he requires to, to be traded with an item in order to actually fully evolve, which is a bit of a pain. Um, other than that, yeah, he's a really good Pokemon, I'd recommend him. Uh, but I'm not gonna get him, but I'm, I'm not gonna get any Pokemon that requires a trade, because that's just, that's just gonna torn him, torn him. So that's why I'm gonna have Turtwig, um, uh, I think I'm gonna have Shinx my ending party. I definitely know one more. You guys may know who that is. Know me personally. Hopefully. It's kinda hard to find, so yeah. Anyway, so we took out the Geodude. Anyway, let's get that item and actually walk down to the steps. Come on. Get it? Yeah! X Defend! This is an item that you use in battle and increases your defense. 
bom, bom, bom. This is a zoo bat. Yeah, now let's send our Shing so he can get. So Friday he will burn into a baddie's cake. Why does it when he's both he turns into a cake? I don't really know what you mean by looking at me funny. But my shoes is comfy, so I don't really know what to do. I, I, I told you I can't make lyrics to anything. Oh, he came through shakes. Yeah. Okay, so anyway, we're in all of our mind. I'll see you guys next part.